Oh, that was great. Oh, that was great. Ooh, yeah, dude. I could do this all day. <laughs> That's <You got> it. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> All right, so today, today is going to be insane. We are going to try to push the boundaries of golf filming today. We are going to try to get the most epic golf footage we can possibly get. All right, so you might be asking yourself, how are we gonna do it? How are we gonna get the most epic golf video shot ever? And the way we did it is we hired an FPV drone pilot to meet us here. He should be here any minute and if you guys haven't heard of an fpv drone it is a very specific very technical type of drone flying that allows people to get shots like these so we thought why not do that on the golf course how can we push the limit so today we're going to try to do that and like i said we hope i haven't met this guy yet uh, we've been talking on Instagram, uh, and some of his his work is just absolutely incredible. But he should be here any minute, and then we're gonna go out there with a game plan to get some ridiculous shots. Dude, how psyched are you for today? I don't know what to expect. I heard it's loud, this thing, huh? I heard so too. I haven't done one first. I'm stoked. I've seen him all over Instagram, and now we get to create our own. Let's see if we get that epic shot. 10 o'clock, man. Getting nervous? I'm getting nervous. Let me tell you something, I didn't sleep last night. I know. All I could think about last night were these shots that we want to try to get. So, I know I talked to him this morning. He's gonna be here. I'm just psyched, so. We're watching that entrance. Man. There's our guy. How's it going? <laughs> Dude, so psyched. What's up, man? So What's up, man? I'm Mike. Nice to meet you, Anthony. Nice to, nice to meet you, man. How was the ride? Oh, it was good, dude. It was beautiful. That mountain ride up Coming there. up that cliff? Oh my gosh. Oh, oh I can't wait sick. to get some, like, dive surfs down like the top of the trees Hell and the foliage yeah. looks amazing oh, let's right do now. it that let's do it, do it. <laughs> <laughs> let's go is this it this is her stuff. Like, <laughs> yeah 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 you gotta fly through the cart he said yeah. Yeah. yeah that's cool like if if my drone's like the comfy minivan with all the like amenities and like the autopilot like that's the ferrari yeah like that your thing, drone tells you where you are in life yeah right this so thing you is like <laughs> he's if you just strip down a drone to pure horsepower that's what this is there's the other one look at that god we are gonna get so many epic shots today <laughs> hey i tell you what there's also gonna be a little bit of pressure on us to pull off the shot it's true so like we if he good. might get the most epic fly through but if we don't Pull off you the mean shot. if that approach shot it goes over the green into like the water, or it doesn't count. It. Exactly. So, so the I pressure's mean, the on. Pressure's on to hit the shot. All right. I like the added pressure. All right. So a big key is going to be scouting shots. So looking for where areas where Anthony can come in, like for, like has room behind the tee box, so he can gain speed. Because what he was saying was, especially for the faster shots, like driver or something like that. He needs to be able to get up to speed. Even though this thing accelerates insanely fast, he's gotta be able to get up to speed. So um, we're gonna be scouting that. We're gonna be moving around, like I said, bouncing around wherever we can find the perfect spot. So this first hole, we're just gonna probably get some balls out there and then look what the approach shots look like. Dude, is there one particular shot you're hoping for today? Is it putting, is it driving? I wanna see him chase the ball in the air. Okay. I wanna see a ball chase. That's gonna be just insane. All right, let's make him chase. Yeah. Anthony, you got enough batteries in there? Check it out. I think we're good, right? <laughs> this is how you know it's serious, right here. <laughs> when you got the multimeter. Yeah. Oh, that's man. That's, that's well above my level. All right, boys, let's make some magic. All right, so this is going to be the location of our first shot. We got a 165 shot, and we're going to have him coming back from the tee box, zooming over our heads, and trying to follow this ball to the green. All right. When do I swing? Um, Probably like three seconds. Not even. When he starts his swing, it's like a second. Um, All right, you're gonna holler swing? Yes. Oh my God. Oh my God, guys, this thing is sick. 
Three, two, one. Oh yeah. Right on the green. Oh, that's great. <laughs> Ooh, yeah, dude. I could do this all day. All right, we might have gotten a good one there, yeah. but we're gonna go scout some other locations. That's a lot of work already. <laughs> so um, to track that ball was actually pretty hard. I thought I could see it in the viewfinder and the goggles, but um, didn't really see it. I think I was too far away. Yeah. When I went a little higher and I had the green, as the background, I think I could see the ball a little easier, so we'll try to go a little higher. Got it. So you got a little bit of anticipation of where it's going to be. You got to anticipate. It. Exactly. Yes. You have to basically fly as if you were on the ball and fly the same trajectory. All right. So he's in. A, he's actually right here, but he's going to start the drone from way back there and try to fly up over Mike and follow it down to this approach here. All right. Here we go. Everybody's in position. What's wild about these drones is so much power. They use that entire brick of a battery in about two minutes. So we've got about two minutes to get the shot before we've got to swap out. So at some point you just got to see like you either got it or you don't cut bait and move on. So now we're going to move on to the next. We got a par three here that could be really pretty. All right, so we're at a par three. It's the third hole. It's such a pretty hole. Love the bridge over there over a creek. So we're going to try to do the same thing we did on the first. Uh, same, same yardage, 140 yards, although we're going to tee it up. It's going to go a little higher. So we told Anthony he's got to punch that throttle when he gets close and shoot that thing up in the air. All right, so here's the shot. Anthony is there. He's going to try to take this drone down around under that bridge, right there, under that bridge, swooping up the hull around Mike and that way. <laughs> I hope we pull this one off. This is going to be the one. This is it. We're ready. All right, let's try it again. Coming around, going under the bridge. Almost. All right, here we go. Three, two, one. All right, after three, I still don't think we have the perfect golf shot yet. We're gonna move on to four, take out some drives, and see if we can get it on the tee box. It's a lot harder than we thought. Oh my god, that's epic. <laughs> yep. I love the through the trees. Oh yeah, here we go, come on. All right, so next shot we're gonna try here is driver. So obviously the ball's gonna be moving a heck of a lot faster than these wedge shots. So what we did is we picked the tee box here with a huge runway of about 100 yards where he can get this thing, even though it accelerates fast, try to get this thing up to speed and then try to, I mean, it would be epic if we could nail it, but follow this drive down the fairway. Hey, Anthony just, Anthony just added more pressure. He goes, is this gonna be the epic shot because he's gonna use his best battery. <laughs> so now the pressure's on. Pressure's on. 
ideally we're gonna do some sort of swoop in effect maybe going under the bridge again and then you have him come down and then try to follow where do I go <laughs> I almost just got killed Almost this, got this, killed this, this, on camera. I love it. I didn't know which way to run. Did you notice that? I had no idea which way to run. Which where, where do I go? Like four? Fine, fine. Anyway, now that I just almost got murdered, um, the idea, like I said, is going to be to use this long runway of tee boxes to get this thing up to speed and just try to follow it down this fairway as much as possible. But the pressure's on to hit a decent drive. Everyone's still alive. You want me to sign a glove or something? Can you please? Be <laughs> great. Oh, that might have been nice. Yeah. All right, going up. All right, let's see. All right, so a lot of reasons this is proving to be a lot harder than it looks. One thing is that we can't really review the footage because we've got to keep moving. We have to take a peek at it before when we let a group play through us, but uh, we got to keep moving. So we're looking for shots and we only got so much battery time. So now we're gonna try something a little different. There's a really short part three here. It's only about 75 yards. We're gonna try starting the drone up and follow it down instead of going up and down, just see if we, what we can get. The pin is about, is down there. It's gotta be about 20, 30 yards below your feet. 20 yards below your feet? 20 yards. And then, but it's a 70 yard shot. I mean, it's almost gonna treat like a 50. We're gonna call this one the skydive shot. The skydive. Essentially, dive. that's what the drone is gonna do. Yeah. A little bit of wind, too. Yeah. Mm hmm Straight towards the middle of the green. <laughs> Dude, that thing rips. When it goes, whew, wow. I think we got it. I think we got the shot. A lot of balls for that green. I think we got that one. I think we might have got it. I think we might have got our approach shot to the green. The skydive shot might be in the books. All right, so we only have a few batteries left, and there's some epic views here at Hollowbrook on the back. So what we're gonna do is we're zipping over to 10. Hopefully, it's not too crowded on the back nine because you guys know I love a good bridge. There's an epic bridge over there, and I'm wondering how creative we can get with it. So we're zipping over to 10 now. All right, so we think this is gonna be one epic location. So we're about 150 yards out here on this hole, which is just one of the sickest holes out here between the tee shot with the bridge and all the waste bunkering up the left side. I mean, it is the venue you want. Um, Anthony is way over that way, probably about 300 yards over, two holes over. He's gonna start the drone way out there. There's some excellent bridges he's gonna try to weave through and then work his way down. And Mike is at about 150 yard shot right here. <laughs> there he is. So the idea is going to be for him to start way out there by the creek, come all the way in, and once he gets to us, to take the shot and then try to follow it. But like I said, he's about 300 yards away. All right, bit of bad news. They just called me from over there, and it appears that uh, something just happened where he broke one of the carbon fiber arms of his main drone but we still have a backup drone but it's not quite the racing drone it's a little bit smaller and slower 
So we're gonna come back down here because this one doesn't have the range. We're gonna try something else, but it looks like that drone is done for the day. But he said he was also on his last battery. So like I said, time was something we were racing against the clock here. But let's see what we can do with the other drone. Now we're talking. That's gonna be sick. Three, two, one. All right, guys, that was the last battery. Goes quicker than you think. That is a wrap. We're gonna head back to the parking lot right now. We're gonna grab that footage and we're gonna take a quick peek. We're just gonna look at it and see what we got. When you absolutely can't wait to see the footage. There's gonna be some fire on those cars, Dude. man. This is that, that moment, you know, you're like, ah. I know we got some good stuff, but let's see what we got. All right, moment of truth. Moment of truth here. Let's see what we got. Oh my God. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. There it is, there it is. <laughs> That's you got it? Yes. All right, I think we definitely got some stuff. We definitely here. got a few gems in there. We got a few gems mm. for sure. If nothing else, that incredible perspective of it just diving in and then you see the whole course and then all of a sudden, boom, right. you see the I golfer. I don't know how we could film again without Anthony there. I know, now we have to have Anthony <laughs> exactly. every single time. But I tell you what guys, so we got some work to do in post. The nice thing too is it's it's big 2K so we can work with it, but we're gonna be sharing that on our Instagram. Make sure you guys follow us on Instagram, at Golficity. Um, but for now, I'll tell you what, let's just run three of our favorite clips. We'll run them right now. And I'll tell you what, love for you guys to vote. Comment one, two or three, which one you think is best. And then like I said, we'll get some work to do. We'll take those clips and we'll try to make them into a bit of fire. I love it. What do you think? Yeah, I love it. Which one had the most epic cool factor? Yeah. Dude, that was so sick. Oh, thank you very much, man. How can Thanks people for having follow me out. you? How can people follow On you? On Instagram, ride underscore dirt. That's it. Awesome. Awesome. Dude, we're definitely going to do that again. Thank you so much. That was awesome. We, I can't wait to do it again. Oh, it's going to be even, even better. Yep. <laughs> yep. All right, man. So that was, that was just so much fun. Couldn't have been happier with the result, but I want to hear what you guys think. So make sure you, you uh, post your comments. Let us know which one it is. And watch Instagram because we're going to put some fire together with oh, this. Oh, yes. We definitely are. <laughs> Let's get to it.